This was the rendezvous point, but he was the only one here. The two men quickly gathered their supplies and ran deeper into the forest. In order not to attract attention, they could only take isolated paths. Not having traveled long, the pilot encountered the renegade long-haired man. He wore comfortable shoes, but didn't bring a pair for the pilot. And there was nothing to say to such a traitor. The pilot decided to trade one of his magazines for a machete on his belt. The man parted ways here. What was the point of escaping? The long-haired man didn't even know where he was going. The blonde man followed the pilot as he ran deeper into the forest. The steady rain solving the water problem for now. The rice brought can be filled with hunger. Machete in the front to open the way. Rifle is now a cumbersome and weeds entangled, but slowed down the pace of progress. The two men took a bamboo raft downstream, hoping that if they could float to the Mekon, they would be out of their misery. It was drizzling. 